I will be their God. Jeremiah chapter 31 verse 33 Christian, here is all that you need. To make you happy you want something that will satisfy you, and is this not enough? If you can pour this promise into your cup, will you not say with David, My cup runs over and I have more than what my heart can wish for. When this is fulfilled, I am your God, are you not a possessor of all things? Desire is insatiable, just like death, but he who fills all in all can fill it. Who can measure the capacity of our wishes? But the immeasurable wealth of God can more than overflow it. I ask you, if you are not complete when God is yours, do you want anything but God? Is his all-sufficiency not enough to satisfy you, if everything else should fail? But you don't just want quiet satisfaction, you desire rapturous delight. O oh, come, soul, here is the music fit for heaven in this your portion, for God is the maker of heaven. Not all the music blown from sweet instruments, or drawn from living strings, can yield such melody as this sweet promise, I will be their God. Here is a deep sea of bliss, a shoreless ocean of delight. So come and bathe your spirit in it, swim in it and you shall find no shore, dive throughout eternity and you shall find no bottom. I will be their God. If this does not make your eyes sparkle and your heart beat high with bliss, then assuredly, your soul is not in a healthy state. But you don't just want present delights. You crave for something you may need to exercise hope. But what more can you hope for than the fulfillment of this great promise? I will be their God. This is the masterpiece of all the promises its enjoyment makes a heaven below and will make a heaven above. Dwell in the light of your Lord and let your soul be always ravished with his love. Get out the marrow and fatness which this portion yields you. Live up to your privileges and rejoice with unspeakable joy. Amen.